Hi, I'm Kelly with the Muncie Public Library, and today I'm going to be reading about a person from the book, The Fierce 44 Black Americans Who Shook the World. And this is going to be, this is written by the staff of The Undefeated Portraits by Robert Ball. Henrietta Lacks was an accidental pioneer of modern day medicine. She was 31 years old and had five children when she was diagnosed with cervical cancer. Just months before her death, doctors at Johns Hopkins Hospital in Baltimore took pieces of tissue from her cancerous tumor without her consent. Lax was not a slave, but parts of her cancerous tumor represent the first isolated human cells ever bought and sold. Her cells, known among scientists as Hella, were unusual in that they could rapidly reproduce and stay alive long enough to undergo multiple tests. Descendants of lax cells live in laboratories across the world and are worth billions of dollars. They played an important part in developing the polio vaccine, cloning, gene mapping, and in vitro fertilization. The Hella cell line has been used to develop drugs for treating herpes, leukemia, influenza, and Parkinson's disease. These cells have been influential in the study of cancer, lactose digestion, sexually transmitted diseases, and appendicitis. While scientists knew her name for many years, her own family did not know her cells were being used or that billions of dollars had been made because of those experiments. It wasn't until a writer named Rebecca Sklut started a book about lax and the Hella cell line that the public learned what had happened, and how little her husband and children knew about her legacy. Her cells are saving lives, to, lives today, but no doctor can be proud of how Lax was treated. Thank you so much for watching, and if you liked this video, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and hit that bell for notifications. If you want more books like this, then you can check out the Muncie Public Library webpage.